hello everyone today i'm going to explain how to configure ospf in microtik router in our diagram we have a two microtik router and three different network we configure routing for communication in different network right we have reset two router there is no configuration we start from scratch so let's see how to configure it first of all we assume that this is our R1 router and this is our R2 router. It will be better to easily identify. We can keep the picture side by side then easily we can configure it. So this is R1, this is R2 and we have a two router reset router first of all we need to change identity how to change the identity system mm, system to identity yes r1 then we are opening another win box and we can give the name r2 system to identity this is r2 yes both router is resetted so first of all you need to configure ip address uh, for lan ip assign when i need to create a bridge interface then let's assign ip address ip to address click plus then 172.16.1.1 slash 24 this this is ethernet 2 interface we are selecting ethernet 2 and we are assigning lan ip address in our bridge 192.168.1.1 slash 24 now let's configure ip address in our router 2 for lan ip assigning we are creating bridge then for assigning ip address ip to address click plus then 192.168.2.1 slash 24 the interface will be bridge the point to point IP 172.16.1.1.2 slash 24 interface will be Ethernet 2. Now we can try to ping from one to another router. We are setting password as its new OS. Uh, now let's ping 192. 168.2.1 from r1 to r2 okay no route to host right let's say from this router 192.168.1.1 no route to host what is the reason behind the reason behind there is a ip address right different ip address so different network if you want to communicate in different network then you need to configure routing right and today our plan to configure ospf here right now the question is how to configure ospf ospf configure is very easy you should just declare your connected network so how you can see what is your connected network you should go to the ip to address you can see there is a two network right so that you go to the routing to ospf then plus assign network here 172.16.1.0 24 then click ok then again 192.168.1 
स्लैश ट्वेंटी फोर वेरी गुड लेट्स डो सेम टैक्स इन द आर टू राउटर राउटिंग पोस्पेफ द कनेक्टेड नेटवर्क वन सेवेन टू डट वन सिक्स डट वन डट जिरो स्लैश टोटी फोर एंड द लैंड ब्लॉक वन नाइन टू वन सिक्स एट डट टू डट जिरो स्लैश टोटी फोर क्लिक एप्लाई टू ओके नाउ यू कैन चेक द पिंग यस पिंग स्टार्टेड राइट यस पिंग स्टार्टेड राइट so our dynamic routing ospf is start working even if you go to the ip to route you can see there is a flag dao dynamic active ospf and the adv value is 110 right thank you for watching